We were expecting to hear from the victim in this case today in the courtroom. The now five year old was supposed to testify, but when it took time for her to take the stand, her prosecutors say she refused to enter the courtroom. We did hear from Tarks today. He did testify. This is video from him just about an hour ago leaving the courthouse. According to the charges, Tarks was taking care of the girl last year while her mother went to the store for about 45 minutes. The next morning, the girl told her mother Tarks had strangled her with a towel, gave her medicine and was mean to her. We heard from three doctors today, witnesses for the prosecution who helped examine the victim when she came to the ER. They said her injuries were consistent with strangulation and sexual assault. Tarks took the stand in his own defense later today, saying he did not hurt the victim and he quote, wish he knew what happened. His attorney says he hopes the jury clears him. We also heard from several of Tark's family and friends. His mom and dad did testify and say they do support him. The trial is expected to resume tomorrow morning, and if convicted on that rape charge, Tark's faces life in prison. Reporting live in Bentonville, Emma Claybrook, 4029 News.